Revel 2 features a universal executor numbering system designed to make the transfer and playback of your show files between multiple console sizes much simpler. Executor faders are fixed with the numbers 1 through 90. On a full-size console, the faders on board are labeled 1 through 30. On a light or ultralight, the faders are 1 through 15. Faders 31 through 90 on a full size, or 16 through 75 on a light or ultralight, can be accessed with up to four external wings. The executor buttons underneath the faders are numbered in a similar style, 101 to 190, again allowing for the possibility for up to four fader wings. The numbers 201 through 220 are reserved for the X keys below the multi-touch screen. All faders and buttons are layered across 9,999 pages. To connect your four motorized fader wings, simply connect the first to the MA Link port on the back of the desk and then daisy chain between the rest of the wings. When connecting the fader wings for the first time, type in the command Align F. This aligns the fader wings with the setup based on the console that you're using and the order of the daisy chain. A view that you might find useful when using wings is located under the playback tab called Playback Small. This is a view similar to the one found at the bottom of the screen above the faders on a light or full size, which provides feedback about what is currently assigned to the executors. This window can be configured to work with any and all the sets of faders, including wings, and can appear on any monitor. This means it's possible to set up an external monitor above a fader wing and have it display the labeling for that particular wing. In addition to holding sequences, chasers, effects, inhibitives, and other playback necessities, the console also has the ability to put the faders into channel mode. Unlike the Series 1, the faders are not automatically assigned to your channels. To start, press either the channel page up or page down keys. To assign a channel to your fader, type in Assign, Channel, followed by the number of the channel, and then touch any button on the desired executor. You can also assign multiple channels using the through key. For example, Assign, Channel, Number, Through Number, followed by an executor button. To have the console assign dimmers to your faders based on the channels already in your patch, you can use the Auto Create menu. In the Setup window, select Auto Create followed by the Channel Pages tab. Here, select the units that you wish to assign, and then where you'd like to begin their assignments. Click Create, and the console will take care of the rest.